Well then, welcome to another episode of Nomad, where we go on our way through the wasteland with permadeath, attempting to go where no man has gone before, and that is into oblivion, because no one has ever come back from oblivion, because it is oblivion. I never really liked Oblivion. I never really liked the uh, Skyrim games or anything like that. Um, they were always, um, or like Morrowind or any of those. They were too, um, too higgledy figgledy, like too open world. And I know that's weird because I'm playing a pretty open world game. Um, but it's different because there isn't like a mainline story. There's the story, there's the, there's the quest line and shit like that, right? But then like... I'm already cussing up a storm. Whatever. It's fine. Everything's fine. I've I've I'm tempted to try to edit these. Let's see if we can cut some of the baloney out. Uh, but at the same time, like my nephews did watch it, I believe, and they're like, Why is he talking the whole time? Just play the game and it's like, Well, oh, buddy, there's 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 different there's different ways to go about it. Some people would just like to watch you play the game, sure. But like, I don't think you really engage the audience and offer anything unique if you don't. Um, and I try to stay high energy, but I also know I'm not high energy. But I also like to try to like narrate and describe what I'm doing to help inform people what I'm doing. Like, so that way people have an idea of like what I'm doing and why. And it might influence their play styles or it might not. Or they might just be interested in the game and they don't get to play it. Um and try to give like a rationale behind my thought process because I, I think that's exciting. Like, I enjoy watching people that do that, right? Because then it's more interesting. I get to see what their thought process is uh, and why they're making certain decisions and then weigh that against my own and see if it makes sense. And that's why I like participating in that seven days to die group on, on Facebook because it gives you a lot of insight. <sighs> Got a blood bag. We got all our stuff. That's right. We're doing full nomad. We gotta go clear. We have food. We have water. Where? Oh, fuck. That was our last water. All right. Well, oh, and we got, we got machine gun. We got pistol. Oh, we're doing... We're doing good. Okay. We got three in here. We'll be able to bump up that one. Let's go do our quest. That was night one. I forgot what exactly what all we were doing. Uh, but we're just going to keep banging out quests. We're going to get that bicycle. Once we get that bicycle, we're going to be uh, ready to rip and roll. What is this? That's just solid. That's fine. I've already done this. What's this one? Black bus mechanical. Is there a mailbox that we can pop? No. Uh, that's okay. I feel like we've already done this one. Did they just pop the same quest? I hate that. I wish there was a way to prevent that from happening. Like always the next POI, like once you complete a quest at a POI, that's it. That's a bad miss. These uh these tough zombies are extra tough, dude. seen a lot of people complain online too about their like melee attacks not working right like in a way that like they're having troubles with combat but like like their old techniques don't work because um, you know they're used to backing up and doing the thing and it's like not enough or whatever but it doesn't make sense to me because 
I'm playing the same way I've always have, and there's really not much of a difference. Um, I think it's just one of those cases where, you know, what we're used to is not exactly, you know, what we planned on. What is this? Untouched. Do we already... I'll take... It's a little less protection, but we don't have that debuff. Uh, which I am totally cool with. Because we can sell that for a lot of money. Uh, we'll scrap that. Got that Sham Chowder, which is pretty clutch early game. Why would you why would you do that to me? We definitely want to see what's in the box. That's the thing too, like if I edit it, what would I edit out? Do I want to show everything? I think so. I like the nice long form, like not to like sniff my own farts or whatever, but like I watch these to go to bed. Like I'll watch my own playthrough and fall asleep to it. A couple of mollies. We'll probably sell those. I don't think we even need to worry about that. We can just get through most of this. We do need to pick up more water. Dude, more sham. Chowder. Why are we getting so much sham chowder? Dude, we have two sham chowders now. That's ludicrous. We don't need the golden rod, do we? No. Uh, we don't need the bones. Let's repair our axe. We don't need the paintbrush because we're not going to be doing any of that. The springs. They sell, but at the same time, we can just scrap it for metal. Get a little wood here while we can. Is it necessary? Oh, oh there's a backpack over here. Some murky water, which we definitely need to make water. I'm here, Pippi. They are a little tougher than normal on the Nomad difficulty. But that was fucking easy breezy lemon squeezy. Gotta stay real light. That was weird. All the loot was split up on this one. It wasn't your typical um, POI. A nice, a nice little break. Nice little mix up. Uh, another level 2 axe. Literally the same quality. Iron bars are nice, but like... I mean, what can we use it for? Honestly, recipe. We can make a repair kit. I mean, I guess that's good to have on us. Might as well use the material we have to do what we need to do. We have pocket mods and all our stuff. Yeah, we got single pocket mods and everything. We got a triple pocket mod there. We don't have anything in our leg or feet. Leg and arm armor. It's probably pretty clutch what we need to work on. But now we have this. We can actually get rid of our torches. Um, which means that frees up a slot for us. We have those mid kits. We definitely don't want to get rid of. What else can we put in our tool belt? Pipe pistol, pipe machine gun. Yeah, dude, we're all set, dude. We are like. We're pretty good. I mean, but what are we what are we at quest wise? We have we've done one. We've done exactly one quest. So we really gotta bang these out. We're gonna try to do the ones as close as possible and just knock them out and get that bicycle so we can get on the move. Uh, where we want our next base to be. That was our previous base. We're just going to keep trying to stay close to the trader for now. Play. 
Oil. Oh, we're gonna grab whatever we can to sell, right? We're trying to stay light, but like when we have the opportunity to sell stuff to make money, I think we should really prioritize that. Let us. It must be my lucky day. Crafting skill, <laughs> Night Stalker volume. I go. Bows do 10% more damage at night. Oh, that's really useful. And so is the crafting skill magazine bundle. So are the mechanical parts so we can make a wrench. Ten percent more damage at night. Sounds really good. That's fine. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna do the crafting skill magazine bundle. Uh, now we are going to sell you, 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 you. Sell that. Sell the oil shale. Sell the machete parts. Keep the pipes for repairs. Sell the sand. Drop it. Clay. Drop it. Cement. Can't sell. We probably should have just scrapped it. Handy land. Repair tool. Crafting skills. These might be useful. Cargo schematic. Oh, we get the, uh... Oh, that's nice. If we can get that thing going. 2100. That'd be real nice to have that right now. You come back sometime. Let's see. Clear zombies. 372. I like you, friend. Godspeed. Robotics crafting, fist crafting, that's all good. Knuckle wraps quality three. Type machine gun quality two. That ergonomic grip on the uh, gloves here is quite handy. This we can uh, just sell it. What else can we sell though? What don't we need right now? Mechanical parts? Don't need the rotten flesh. Uh, peepees, peepoos, peepoo, peepoo, peepoos. Oh, did we just sell our paint? We just sold our painkillers by accident. That's okay. Um, shoot. Salvage tool crafting, handy land, repair tools. Thank you, survivor. Check back soon. Get new merchandise. Ball hammer quality one. Okay, we, we just sold our painkillers, which was not ideal. Um, but that's okay. We'll worry about setting up our base at night. The hoarder's house. I guess, yeah, loot doesn't respawn, right? So there's no point in clearing the stuff. Animal hoarder. Gotta be careful what we want to pick up. Gonna be a dog here. Nope, we're good. Gilbert residence. Uh, harvesting more lead and brass from sinks and plumbing. That's good. Really just want that bike. Why is time ticking so fast? I don't even read what that did. 32 o'clock. Just punched his arm off. Okay.
Okay, I guess that's the carcass of the dog, so. Will we actually run into a dog? I don't know. Aloe is nice. Uh, let's repair that, wear that, scrap that. Can't make first aid bandages yet. That's okay. A little bit of feathers. Anything back here? No. More trash. It's fine. Everything's good. Oral. Everybody likes some oral. We got a zombie brickhead pounding down below. Uh, drop, drop. We need to stay light, though. We need to stay light. Like, I need to just not hold on to stuff until we know what we need to get. You know what I mean? Like, there's no point. There's none. Is there anything up here? We go down. There go. Cloth is good. Bones. We don't really need any of this stuff that we keep picking up. Ideally, we just get rid of this stuff as we go. Keep collecting wood, though, because that's important. Potatoes. Another cooking pot. The coal is nice for fuel. There's anything under the sink. What do we use oil for? Jump magazine mod. We don't even have a workbench yet, so we're not going to worry about that. Lead. Brass. I mean, the brass we can sell. I meet the ball. What do we got? That jacket run speed versus the cold resist. I mean, are we gonna? We're eventually gonna get into the cold biome, right? Do we worry about the puffer coat then? I like the idea of run speed. A duster? Dude. It's very tempting. Magazines.
stamina is pretty low. Get caught on the body gore. I like that swipe from the bottom trying to get us. It's nice. This ain't any better than what we have now. No. Got the exploding arrows, scrap gloves, we can sell. Earl, more Earl. Business shoes. Shoes, whatever. Not a big deal. Gun store box. Pipe rifle. Iron arrow tips. That's really useful. If we could actually get more iron arrow tips. The robotic turret ammo. Electronics crafting. Crate. Renerator. Water. That was the other way up and out. But we also have this they added. Which is way more ideal to escape this POI. I think that one comes out underneath the thing there. Let's check around front. We can't get some more goodies here. Oh, we're out this way. The iron arrows though, like nine of them. We're not going to really want that. That's the run speed's really useful right now, but once we get the um where we gotta go this way. Once we get the bike, we'll be able to store stuff, you know. But like are we gonna be able to find another puffer coat when we go into the snow biome? You know, or do we just switch to the do we just switch to the that and but like when we're in the when that when we're in that area, I mean we're we're specking into this, right? Well insulated. You'll never have the more severe stages of temperature status effects. Like we can we can do that. But we're definitely gonna up I'm gonna do machine gunner or scrap or bullet. Yeah, let's do let's keep using our fists. See if we can clear one more POI before nightfall. I mean, we definitely can. Anyway, just pick one. Like we'll go complete this quest, turn it in, and then uh, the army camp's gonna be a bitch to undo. Out of stamina. Definitely eat that sham. Shamway hamway. Now go gratitude, friend. Economic weighted head mod. Armor pocket. Not that we're gonna even be able to craft that. Weighted head mod. Can we even we can only fit one on here, so there's no point in Many getting that right now. You've proved to be very resourceful. We're gonna get the armor we're gonna get the armor pocket mod. This we're, gonna, we're just going to sell these. We're going to sell the parts. We're going to sell the rifle. We're going to sell that. Sell that. Scrap. Sell all that. Oil. Chairs don't sell for anything. Uh, can we sell these for two? That's fine. We'll scrap the rest. 
Sell the plastic. Sell the lead. Sell the patates. Can we sell a cooking pot? We can sell a cooking pot. That's fine. So now we have... See, this is going to be so useful later. I don't want to spend all our money on it, but we're going to. Because... Doing business with you. If we can get to have a drone, then that is going to increase our storage capacity uh, I'll, I'll, a lot, which will be nice. We'll get one more slot in here, which brings us up to here for uh, all that. Can we make, make single pocket mods, but no double pocket mods yet. Let's get another job, clear zombies. Or three for the cell, shade break. tree auto. I look forward. Yeah. We got that stamina boost from the sham chowdas. Scrap that. Scrap that. Dude, we don't need the fat. Really need to drink. Could really use some water. I thought that sham chowder increases our health water. Oh, 10. Only 10. So that's why. I mean, we'll be okay for this POI. We're going to level up. Probably going to put a point into the uh, iron gut. Just to reduce the amount of shit we have to worry about food wise. But. Might also increase our machine gun abilities. Cause that's gonna be pretty 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 clutch pretty soon. A ten percent speed boost is nice though, not gonna lie. Just an empty shack. It's already getting late. to go goes <sighs> cardio stamina regen iron gut hold your breath chance of dysentery reduced buff some consumables last number is only reduced food by five percent It's really important for this. Or punching 10% faster. Fuck. What do we want to do? We gotta come up with something. Um, honestly, for Nomad, that's pretty clutch. I don't have to eat and drink as much. We're running out of time here. This might be the POI we hold up in. Uh, at least for the night. Let's clear it. Let's get the mission done. Definitely where we're going to hold up. Um, get more murky water. Can. Yeah, we're going to come back here. Let's go turn in our quest. Let's mark it. Oh, save waypoint. 
two. There we go. Okay. I think we'll be able to get there and back in time, and then we'll finish looting at night. Just want to turn the quest in and get the next quest. Don't know why the time is moving so fast. It's been 30 minutes. I mean, I guess that makes sense. We're gonna get this. Be able to cook our water. Cutting it close, dude. Stuff's just despawning, that's perfect. But here is your reward. I owe you one. Zooming uses less. No, oh, magazine bundle. Let's do it. Sell it, we can sell. That's fine. Restocks day four. Grave digger. Those are actually not bad mods to get on our tools really early. Proof uh, workstation crafting. Do we buy it? Yeah, I mean, real pleasure. You watch yourself out there. I have a task. You the man. Okay, there we go. Oh shoot, where's our Put our quick waypoint over here We can try to do that quest at night But first we're gonna We're definitely gonna get Our little temporary night base Set up Probably a dog in there. We're not fucking with a dog right now. We'll definitely get our cooking pot and stuff set up. We'll be near the next mission. Maybe we try it at night. I think we can. We'll play. I like to play a little risky. You know what I mean. ourselves a little bit of a home team advantage up here campfire get that going that's more fuel than we need minutes five minutes that's fine I'm gonna eat that to make some room repair what we need to repair boiled meat yucca juice electrical traps rifles that's fine um still can't make that that's a problem Where's the duct tape? More duct tape to make room. Wood crate. Urban combat. Craft military stealth boots which have no stamina penalty. Moving and reduce noise from Okay, meat stew. 
Crossbow. This we can sell. Shotgun ammo we don't really need. Uh, what do we got over here? We got a crate we can hit. If we get some better tools, that would be nice. Like a fire axe or something. Cash money. Let's see what's up there, though. Oh, would you look at that? sell for a lot um meat stew water eh. eat the meat stew or the sham health 80 health 50 oh health 25 yeah this is we're gonna do this to fill up make some room make some more arrows these would be nice to sell Uh, we can drop the bones, that, the clay, sand, rotten flesh, the two shotguns, we don't need the gas, the uh, shotgun cells, shells, eh. Everything else we're gonna hold on to. This will be our water. Honestly, we can leave this here for the night. Let's go clear that POI. We should probably drink the water. We'll take it. Water. Is this going to be a mistake? be okay we have ammo in case we're in a heap plenty of bandages here's my secret if I have enough bandages and cloth are hard to find okay. Really, oh shit, deer. What? Are we overshooting the deer? Oh my god, he just turns his head right in time. What the fuck? What? What? That went right through him. Can I make a new bone knife? No, we don't need it. Get rid of that. The fat. Do we really need it?
That actually took up a lot of damage. That guy beat us up a little bit. Let's, um, five health. It's also five health. I mean, we can eat our way to health. That we have food. mistake um we're not trying to die we're also not trying to get an infection so Repair this. <laughs> Don't need any of that. There's definitely going to be a bird that flies at us up here. Two pipe machine gun. That's okay. Let's sell it. Repair it and sell it. All good in the hood. Shamware. Bacon and eggs and coffee. Another bondagio. Really like to get more medical supplies. But, uh, Can't always get what you want. I don't understand like what's going on with the aim mechanics here. Just like really agitated. More books. Let's just repair this while we can. So we can actually, we'll take this, put this on there. It'll sell for a lot more. Red 
Okay. Snake chilling out, dude. That wasn't too bad. Technically didn't even stay in a POI at night. We basically just used that place to set up our campfire. Might just stay mobile. Like once we have a vehicle, who, the fuck, who, who cares? Wrench quality two. Fuel to sell maybe? Put your pizzas right there, that's always good. A little bit of glue on. Craft fireman helmets take 5% less damage when wearing them. Cooking drill. Mushrooms are good, right? This will cook up more water. Um, we can find having this flashlight mod is really nice too. It'll give us a minute to sort out our stuff. Water, cook the more grilled meat. That will get us to ten. This we can scrap. Don't think we can use yeah, that's later that's later stuff. Springs. Grass we don't need, rotten flesh we don't need, repair the bones, get rid of the bones, cornmeal we can sell. Glue, duct tape, like what can we use? Like machine gun, eh, but like then we can like decide when we want to do that. I'd rather save the inventory space. This is a cell, this is a cell, this is a cell, this is a cell. These are handy for crafting stuff. 
Oh, look at everything despawning very rapidly. What can we use these for? Pocket mods, insulated liner mod, running shoes, worn boots. Yeah, once we can get this recipe, we'll be good. So let's go get five chrysanthemums. find or sell some chrysanthemums. Usually pretty easy to find. One, two, three, four, Oh, we're sitting pretty. Now we can make red tea. Five of those. That's six minutes. We need, ooh, we need a lot. We need a lot of fuel there. <clears throat> Fine. So that. That. I mean, that's a lot of goodies to sell. And now I believe we have a skill point we can put. Grease monkey will be nice. We need intellect level 2 for that. HP loss is pretty critical right now. So is that. Gain 10% insulation against heat and cold. Lose 15% less food and water when cold or overheating. But we can also put a point into here. That opens up the other stuff we had. We had the, I think this was, this gave us the, yeah, plus one fortitude when you eat the sham chowder. So we had a buff that we weren't quite ready for. We can't make cigars, can we? No. We would need testosterone anyway. Level 3 pipe baton. I wonder if, watch this. Take the cooking pot, right? Let's get the grilled meat going. But we're also gonna do a campfire. There we go. That way the meat cooks, and that cooks simultaneously. It's about to be daytime. Well, that's going. Let's go check out. Hotel 8. Is this a hard one? There's a single one.
Might as well loot, you know? Fuck, that made me jump. Are still not open till six. Now that we cleared this out, we might be able to use this POI next night. Almost make medical stuff.
Yeah, yeah that's fine. Paper. Paper. Water. Oh, three pipe shotgun, that's nice. Iron arrows, scrapping. Go grab your stuff. Can we get rid of 50, 70, 50? Let's get modify that. Let's get that blue dye. Let's modify. Let's get that. There you go. That's nice. What do we got here? Modify purple. Let's put the purple on our. We probably should just do our uh, thing at my bob. It's all done cooking. Yep, that's good. Paper. Take that. We need the grill. Let's, uh, what do we drop? 50 50. We can get rid of one of these. Let's go turn in our quest. I'm so lost. So that was night two. We need to head back up here to trade with Bob. We'll probably call it a night. Let's go. It's a long way, I guess. That was interesting, though. We're doing okay. We're not careful and we get overwhelmed. And like say we don't have our guns loaded. Potentially in a lot of trouble. All this stuff, we got a ton of stuff to sell. This quest will be good. That'll be three quests we got done in this episode. Which is pretty sweet. This is pretty easy. This game is kind of easy. Oh, we're also skilled. All right, we've already figured out how the zombies work, right? So. It is a little interesting trying to like manage the inventory. But it's also not that hard. Like we're just thinking about our immediate needs and we can usually find just about whatever we want uh, when we get into like crafting some of the bigger ticket items and stuff we're gonna have to make like a workbench that we just pick up we put a land claim block down do that we'll take it up and then we store it in our vehicle. your money is welcome here sure it is friend uh, shotgun what can we actually drop that we don't we're not gonna be able to sell here you go friend whatever you need water mechanical parts armor plating mod 
We're okay on water. Um, I guess the armor plating mod. You got a clear zombie. Just God bless you. And good luck. Let us sell. So that, so that, so that, so that, so that, so that, so that. We want the pipe shotgun? No. We can sell that. We can sell that. Sell that. Can't sell that. Sell that. <laughs> we don't really need this much iron. Um. Play we don't need. Coal is useful for cool fuel, but we also don't really need it on us. We're supposed to restock day four. Is this not day four? It's not day three. Scrapping tools, spear hunter. Is there anything, is there anything really important we could buy that might give us a leg up right now? Level 4 padded chest armor. Cooking pots, tools, lockpicks, no. Weapons, is there anything better than what we have now that we can justify spending the money on? Nope. Bicycle handlebars, nope. Water filters are useless to us because we're not setting up the base. The mods, the wood splitter mod, we'll throw on our axe. I'm just gonna do that. Um, that padded chest armor is tempting. We'll do it. Pleasure doing business with you. Right now it's just level one. We'll do that. We'll get to level four. We'll put the armor on there. The likelihood that we ever get rid of that. Sells four, not a big deal. Everything else? Oh yeah, I'll sell this too. Everything else? I think we're good. Thank you, kind sir. Um. Yeah, that's it. We're gonna call it fucking. We're gonna call it here. Anyway, thank you all for watching. See you next time. Let's see what see what see what challenges come up. Probably nothing crazy. But until next time. Toodles. Have a wonderful whatever.